Online PR is all about community. For decades, many public relations practitioners seeking to influence their target audiences have primarily focused on building relationships with journalists at newspapers, magazines, TV and radio. But the online media world's diverse, networked and above all community nature requires a different approach. To achieve influence, you need to get involved in this world through listening, being accepted by the community on their terms, providing relevant and quality content, engaging people in conversations and building relationships. Think of it like being a guest at a party where you don't know many people. At first you wander around listening to conversations and eventually you find people talking about something relevant to you. At this point, you might be tempted to pitch in with a story, comment or perspective of your own, but you remember that first impressions count. Before you talk about your latest achievement, consider the people you're talking to. Make sure the content of what you say is going to be relevant and interesting to them. Having got involved in the conversation, you must now ensure that as it develops, you take the time to get to know these people better. Don't disappear, never to be heard from again. If your conversations are interesting, it's likely that some of those you meet will invite you to their parties and talk about you to their friends. But relying on other people's invitations might make getting to know people a slow process. To quickly meet more like-minded people, you could organize your own party. You'll need some guests, which means gaining people's acceptance. Trying to force people to come just won't work and is likely to lead to negative reactions. There are the people that you have already met and they might bring along some of their friends. Or perhaps you can identify some other people you are confident will appreciate being invited. Next, you need to think about the content you present to your guests. The food, drink and entertainment. Causing harm to your guests' health or sensibilities won't make you popular, so it's important to take account of their interests and preferences. You could even ask them if they would like to contribute something to the evening. The content you present should also be of sufficient quality and interest to engage their attention and facilitate an interesting conversation. It's no good inviting all these people on the promise of gourmet food and then serving them cheese on toast. Do all this and everyone should have a fantastic time. Your success should mean that they're keen to invest in the relationship and recommend you to their friends, leading to you getting approaches from more and more relevant people and becoming a valued member of the community in the online media world.